Damatha battling Gonzaga at the PG Sports and Learning Complex Friday night. The Stags could clinch the top seed in the WCAC playoffs with a win. Both teams would be without their respective starting quarterbacks in this matchup, but they still found ways to light up the scoreboard. Let's pick up the action in the first quarter. Gonzaga inside the Stags' 5-yard line, needing a touchdown on 4th down. They run the Wildcat to junior running back Reggie Corbin, wiggling his way into the end zone. Eagles up 7-0. Gonzaga would keep the pressure on, and sophomore quarterback Matt Mulligan goes deep. Jabari Greenwood beats two defenders for the score, looking like Des Bryant just needs to throw up the X. Gonzaga up 14-0, but this game far from over. DeMatha rallying. First, they feed the ball to slippery running back Lorenzo Harrison. Look at those moves. He could be on Dancing with the Stars as he scores. DeMatha makes it a 14-7 hole. The Eagles, though, would bounce back, giving the ball to Robbie Walker, the senior runner, into the end zone off of the corner. The Eagles go back up 21-7. Corbin giving us a little instant replay on the sideline as the Eagles enjoying the lead. But later in the second quarter, Jamal Robinson taking over at quarterback. The baby brother of the former Stags basketball star James goes deep. Cam Phillips is a beast. Comes down with it and he is flexing as the Stags cutting the lead to 21-14 at the break. In the second half, DeMatha just seizing control. Allowing the Eagles just three offensive snaps in the third quarter. They would wear them down with running back Taiwan Deal just bruising his way through the Eagles defense. Then Deal would tie the game at 21 going off tackle. He's just getting it done here tonight. The Stags taking their first lead on this field goal. And then Deal sealing the deal, driving the nail into the coffin with this nifty run into the end zone as DeMatha goes on to win 31-21. Here's what the Stags had to say about the big win. You know, we wanted to stick with our game plan. Um, we, we knew we had to control the line of scrimmage. And, uh, you know, we put it on our seniors, put it on our, our senior captains, and they did a great job of just controlling the second half of the game. You know, up front, I thought our line did a fantastic job all, all day of getting solid push. And then it wasn't just deal. We had Mark Allen, we had Lorenzo Harrison. Those, that's a three-headed monster that's just, just tough to deal with on the high school level, and they did a great job. Uh, it means a lot. Anytime we're playing against Gonzaga, it's a big game, let alone on senior night for the first seed. So we, um, this is a big game, and it means a lot. It gives us momentum going into the playoffs. Uh, you know, uh very pleased. Uh, you know, I was confident going into the game. He had a great week of practice. So, uh, you know, you know, he just kept plays alive, did a good job, uh, you know, just helping us keep the momentum and uh, had, a, had a good game for us. For DCSportsFan.com, I'm Brian Kapoor.